We just got here at Lacrosse Fairground Speedway. Uh, we're gonna unload as much as we can before we gotta go sign in uh, for today's events. And we'll see what today's circus brings us. Over at 18, right? Yeah, I'm 27. <laughs> it, sometimes it's just hard to tell, right? Thank you. Thank you. I'm making a stupid face or something. You always make stupid faces. <laughs> I'm always smiling and you're always like. Wait, so this is my face. All the time, smile. And this is Derek. So the sun was in my eyes. You can't yell at me for the sun being in my eyes. I'm not yelling, I'm making fun of. That's worse. <laughs> He's a perfectionist. Watch him unroll this thing three times. <laughs> this is where you get the perfectionist from? Your grandpa? Yes. <laughs> I try and teach him. But... <laughs> All the wrinkles out. <laughs> and then they make fun of me. It really pisses me off. <laughs> we make fun of Derek too when he has to have everything so perfect. Got the car unloaded, everything's ready to go. It is 12 o'clock, I believe, and practice starts at three, so we have some time to get anything done that they that they need to get done before practice. A little princess can sit here. Thank you. We're gonna bring the car through tech, pre-race tech. Also for our notes. So we haven't had it on the scales very We much. haven't gone through tech, period. We haven't done anything other than this, going on the scales. I don't think this car has been through a tech with us yet, so. So you're saying this will be interesting. I only brought two wrenches, so. <laughs> We're just here picking out the race tires. Uh, pretty important to get the sizes right. If you get sizes that are way too different, it does some crazy things to the car. So uh, very important, kind of time consuming, searching for the right tire matching and pairs. And at the end of the day, it's just a guess. So hopefully we guess right. The car is going through tech right now. They check like the body and make sure that things are where they need to be. They check the weight the left side weight, all sorts of different things. So we're rolling through tech right now. We're already having to change some things. So this is getting interesting. 79 and a half. Okay. So you guys can actually come out. Yep. Ooh, that's good. I like to hear that. Take it, take it back to white back. Raise this up a little bit. You might have to adjust a little. You're under 27. So we just got back from tech. Uh, a few things to work on. Um, 
left side weight percentage. It's written down on tape over here, so because I forgot. <laughs> okay, I'll inform everyone. Oh. So the left side weight, the percentage was 58, and that needs to be lower. I don't know the exact number, so we have to take some weight out of the left side. Also, 2750 is the weight we need to weigh, and we were 2744. And then what? There was one other thing, body-wise, that needed to be fixed. Deck lid and rockers. The deck lid and rockers. Rockers okay. are fine. We just had more room. Okay. So, not a lot. So that's really good. This car's never gone through tech until right now, and I think we're looking pretty good. Go through the schedule for tonight. Colin Rutter, if you can step forward, we'll have you draw our number. Qualifying number for late model super late session. 36. 36 will start us off. Qualifying for super late will be two laps, one car at a time. We're getting closer and closer to practice. We still have to go through tech, but I'm on sandwich duty. I'm making all the guys some delicious sandwiches. Trying to rush to get ready for practice. The cars are uh, lining up right now to go out. We still gotta roll through tech one more time. Have them give us the, the okay that we're good to go. I'm just uh, gonna gear up so hopefully they say we're good and I can roll right on the track. went as good as expected uh, found a lot of things that we wanted to change on the car uh, made improvements so that's a good sign uh, we're gonna go roll through pre-tech qualifying qualify and we'll see what this thing's got so much ever since we've been here racing I feel like I haven't gotten to talk to you very much so we just finished with qualifying Derek qualified p9 it was the fastest lap he ran all day so we're really happy with that but the car is still not exactly where we want it to be he's walking up right now so maybe he can tell us a little bit of what he needs out of the car to make it better it was still just a little bit tight to qualifying so do you think we, the uh, left front needs to come down, like stay down more? Because it just still looks like it's not... It's not an option, so get that out of your vocabulary. Okay, so that's as best as it's going to be for weekend, today. This weekend, that's not an option. Okay. Um, the sweeper on the adjuster on the shock is locked up for some reason. Weird. And I'm not taking apart a shock at the racetrack when we don't have another one. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. Every time we hit the track today, we've gone faster, so faster than the session before. Um, so we'll see. I don't, I don't know if they do inverts or what they're doing tonight. So, and for those of you who aren't following along for this race here at Lacrosse, it's two features tonight. Both are 44 laps. So he's got two features to run. They're short races. They just finished up uh, the driver interviews from the race before us. We're about to get in the cars, pull them up onto the front stretch, do some driver intros, and then uh, the first uh, 44 lap feature tonight. You look like a dirt racer. 
racer wearing your hybrid to the driver intros. I wish I was a dirt racer. check out the race shop we haven't been there yet work on some race cars got a seat in back here we got a mount so stay tuned for some fun stuff coming up a uh, little recap on the race weekend the first feature um, started I think fourth kind of fell backwards but the the good takeaways from that is the car maintained throughout the whole race so it didn't get worse, it didn't get better, but it didn't get worse. So we're gonna use it as a building block. We went out for the second race. I think on lap two, I got left reared by another black and orange car. What are the odds of that? Almost swore, this is a family channel. Thanks for watching, love you all so much and stay tuned for where and what we are doing next. Bye.